Hey guys, we made it outside here at the F100 Super Nationals in Sevierville, Tennessee. Got a lot going on, plenty to look at. Got a lot of good trucks, a lot of cars out here still. This is an all Ford show as well, but uh, got a little something going on over here I think we'll all kind of like. Looks like we got a little coyote action going on in this old F100 here. Let's go back here and talk to our owner, get a little more information on this beautiful truck. Tony, how you doing, sir? Doing good. Got a good looking truck here. I appreciate it. Why don't you tell us a little bit about what you got going on? Uh, it's a 72 F100. Uh, I just put it on a 2014 uh, Mustang, a wreck. Just used everything the Mustang had, tried right, to. Okay, so you got a little blend of modern comforts with the old classic style. Yeah. All right. I mean, everything is on the Mustang I tried to put on the. Yeah. Well, I noticed you had the coyote badges under there. So put my quick feel on here. there, so from nice. the Mustangs. Nice. And uh, like I said, it's got the stock 5 0. And... And they got all the creature comforts in there. Yeah, it, I would use the Mustang gauges and wow. uh, the dash and AC and just everything that Mustang had but the airbag. Right. That's the only thing I haven't right. used. Okay. That looks good. It's very and well it's, done. Uh, it's a 373 car, Brembo brakes, and yeah. a six speed. All the good stuff. Let's take a look under this hood here. Look, and it's I got used, an actuator on the hood. Well, that's from the Mustang also. Right. The trunk and the, the hinges are from the back of the very Mustang. Very nice, very nice. But, but it runs pretty good. Yeah, it's a good driving truck. I put <laughs> yeah. about 12,000 miles on it so far. Okay, so, so it gets real. It gets, it gets Yeah, used. I use I pull a boat yeah. with it and everything. That's the best. We love it. A lot of people think you can't do it if you do a, do one like this. Right, proving them wrong. <laughs> so tell us a little bit about some of the styling here. You uh, I narrowed the bumper a little bit, and uh, it's the stock grill. I just right. painted it. Painted so. it up, yeah. It's got a nice combo going on, though. I do like that blue and the gray and the black, the flat black striping. Yes, it turned out pretty good. Yeah, I'd say so. <laughs> factory uh, grill, you said. Yeah, you it's got the fact some... the stock grill that come in the truck. Yeah. It's a long wheelbase. Uh, I'm uh, short, and it made it into a short bed. Okay. How much so. did you cut out of the back of it back there? Uh, Whatever the stock was, I think seven in the front, maybe. Right. I forget what it was. Yeah. Got the nice vents going on in the hood up here. Plenty of air and ventilation under that hood. I'd say that helps out. Yeah, I'd say it wouldn't hurt to have a little airflow. No, it wouldn't here. Let's see what, uh, so you got the factory brakes and suspension under it from the Mustang, you said. What kind of wheels are those? Uh, I think they were Shelby wheels, Mustang wheels. I'm kind of okay. limited what come on a Mustang, right, you know, yeah. because of the brake package. Yeah. But well, it looks it's good. also on air, so that's... Right. I noticed you had the bed floor raised up, and it's sitting pretty low here. Yeah. I, that's about as low as I got it right there. I mean... Yeah. You, you set it much higher for driving, or you like to keep it kind of low, or... Uh, about an inch and a half up, you know, That's when I drive it. So. <laughs> Still got that nice tuck going on. I like how you integrated the exhaust into the side of the bed there. And also used the uh, one touch Mustang power wind as well. Okay, yeah, that's right. You've integrated all the electronics in yes, there for all the everything. comfort features. I like it. You don't see a lot of them done this, to this extent. I've seen some of the trucks that come with, you know, a modern dash or a modern console, but they don't always have everything in there like that. Even got the Mustang door handles, it looks like. Yeah, I wanted to use the remote, you know. Right, yeah, you got everything from the yeah. car as it was, fully functional in there. That is awesome. I, I appreciate it. Like I said, it's just a good driver. I want something yeah. I can drive. And go How much where time I do you go. think you've got in it just getting it to it that point? It took me a year, but okay. I'm retired, so I, I have plenty, plenty of time, time to play with it. <laughs> well, it's turned out great. I, I, I can't say enough about it, really. I'd like to get it out on the road sometime, but you know. <laughs> I bet you would too. It's good that you drive it though. And a lot of these things sit yeah. too long and they're just all for show. But I, I like how you drive them if you're going to have yeah, them, man. You gotta, you gotta really appreciate the whole thing. Well, Tommy, we really liked it, man. We're I glad you gave it. us some time here to talk about it. And uh, hope you do good out here at the show and have a good time. Well, thank you. We're gonna head out and see what else we can come up with out here. There's a lot to see, so stick around.